Previously on Lion Moms. I couldn't have done it without you and I want to get you something. What would you like? I'm just happy that you did well. I know what I can give you. A hug. Do you really find studying and homework more exciting than friends? You were never like this. You don't understand. Mr. Claude is more than just a teacher. Much, much more. What's the point of having a family dinner? You guys are using your phone. I I'm sorry, Sang. It's just that I have to finish some this work. This is your dinner table. It's not your work desk, right? I think Mommy and Daddy are fighting. Do you know why? No, but they don't talk to each other like they used to. Stop using the family to cover your legs, personality! I am the family! You are just merely part of it! No, it's not. That's what you just said! I want this relationship to be special, Nabs. Open it. It's so pretty. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Do you like it? I love it. But why? It's a reward for scoring so well in your last practice test. And I remember someone saying something about books weren't real presents. Thank you, Mr. Clark. Don't tell your mom, okay? She thinks the good results should be their own reward. Creative making program. You joining? The instructor for fashion is Ilin Tang from the fashion label Love You. Her clothes are sold in Hong Kong and New York. Oh, Ilin Tang is amazing. Have to select right. How do you know you will be chosen? She can try. Isn't the section process to create a piece or something? Mm -hmm. Anything we want. I'm gonna design a dress. That sounds perfect for you. You're always doodling those cool fashion designs. Eh, hey, as if you know anything about fashion. Better than you. Luckily, Kylie stepped in to save me from a date disaster. Hmm? Whatever. Hey, Sam. How's your homework going? Good. I've been wanting to talk to you about your daddy and I will... What are you doing? Where did you get that headband from? None of your business. Nabila Reza! I'll deal with you later. I tried talking to her, but she's suddenly so antagonistic, so secretive. Well, I have seen flashes of this behaviour before. Really? You too? Of course. I mean, it's normal at this age. Although sometimes, you know, trust and abandonment issues in adolescence can stem from... conflicts between parents. Don't worry, Mrs. Gerani. I'll speak to her. It shouldn't be a problem. I can tell that she's very close to you and Mr. Reza. Thank you so much for your help, Claude. No problem. Classes, there is the law, social economy status, there is the... Muslim I don't even see in the textbook. It's an interesting one. It was not tested. My screw! What are they doing here? Don't touch my things. Actually, huh? they are my things. You stole them. Actually, they are Ma's things. To Ma already, she gave them to me. What are you doing with them? Ma program for the creative making selections. I may go for it. 
industrial look. Industrial look or idiotic look? Who wants to wear screws? I think that's a really inspired idea. See me, it's inspired. It means brilliant, good. I think incorporating a mechanical background into your design is clever. Hey, good then say good lah. Don't use big words on us, can not? Hey, he's teaching you English, so you may finally pass your combo. Oh, so now people praise you, they must speak up for him lah. Stop wasting your time lah. You think the school will select you? They always choose the same old people. Like, like Winston. The school selected him to take part in a public speaking competition. That's because I've always emceed at Charleston School events. See? <laughs> Are you taking part in the creative making selections too? No, no, no. I don't have a single creative cell in my body. I'm just book smart. Book smart or sell smart, if you join, <laughs> they'll sure select you. And there'll be one last chance for me. Hey, hey. What makes you think you have any chance? Ah? Eileen Tang is my idol. She's the inspiration behind my reusable fashion project. I have to get in one way or another. So for what? Stop wasting your time. Lah. Look, I just made $300 selling used rims last month. How much can your dress sell? Nothing. For now, when I become a famous fashion designer, my dress can fetch 3000 Stop dreaming. Lah. Hey, you know anybody want to buy used rims? Yeah. Welcome class. Thank you for coming to school on a Saturday. It shows your commitment. Cha! This is a good program. You want us to come on Sunday also? <laughs> your class form teachers have proposed your names for the creative making program. I'm quite impressed with some of the designs. Will this program help us get into a JC? Let's put it this way. It won't hurt your chances. I am returning your proposals now. We expect to receive your submissions by Friday. We will announce the final 10 by the end of this month. I like your concept. Very green. Hey, why don't you go and rest? You shouldn't be exerting yourself. I'm fine. This is easy. I think you should just... Uncle Bing here. do you know of anyone who wants to buy good second-hand car rims? Mm, not particularly, why? My friend, Spencer, he wants to sell them. Make more money for his family. Spencer is a better boy than he looks. Didn't you tell us not to judge a book by his cover? <laughs> hey, yeah, I was abing before, right? But I'm okay. Who says you're not an abing now? Oh, very clever, huh? Hey! <laughs> anyway, um, Winston, I'm honestly much more interested in motorbikes, but uh, I'll go and ask around for you, okay? How about a, a fashionable dress, Mum? You should know better than to ask me. I haven't shopped for a dress in years. Why don't you ask Auntie Min? Mum, hmm? is there any way I can help make money for the family? Your job now is to study. You have plenty of time to work when you graduate from university. I knew you would say that, but all the kids in my school, they're all helping out with their families and... What's wrong with just... Because... You know, Winston, actually, if there is one thing that I do collect, it's old recipes. In fact, there's this old pineapple tart recipe I've been hunting for forever. It's by the late Mrs. Lim Sweatney, and it's gone out of print as far as I can tell. But the thing about this recipe is, it predates the one in her actual published cookbook. I tell you, I would pay good money, I'm talking about hundreds of dollars here, okay? Just to get my hands on that. What's so special about this recipe? Well, apparently the ingredients are different from the ones in the cookbook. And the way that she fluffs up the pastry, apparently it's by some special secret method. I would love to get my hands on that. Okay, you know what? 
Time for me to go. I gotta get off to the, uh, the other kitchen, my kitchen. <laughs> Give me that. Thanks for your help. It's nothing. See you again, Winston. Bye, go back here. Mom. Yeah? I know I've been rude to Uncle Bing Hien before, but if you really like him, it's okay. Hi, Nabs. So I just had a chat with your mom. Oh. She says that you need to be more understanding with Harris. You need to act like a big sister. I hate him. All he does is eat, sleep and cry. So useless. I know. I, I tried to explain to her that the firstborn usually needs more attention, but she wouldn't hear of it. Try not to let your problems with your parents bother you too much, okay? I've always been closer to my friends than with my family. The way I'm so close to you. I have a surprise for you today. I sent you my heart. You kept it safe. This is to say thank you for that. It looks nice on you. I asked you to show me your heart too, remember? I doubt she would notice. Maybe she's going through premature menopause. Maybe that's why she's so irate. Premature menopause? Unfortunately, none of us can choose our family. Your friends are the family that you choose for yourself. I choose you, Nabila. Do you choose me? You mean, choose you to be my friend? I consider you to be much more than a friend. You and me, we're soulmates. Soulmates? The ancients believe that there's a perfect mate for each of us. Twin souls. We understand each other, we heal each other. Others may not understand us, but we understand each other perfectly. Okay. What about your ex-girlfriend? Your former student? Was she a soulmate too? I wouldn't give a beautiful ring like this to just anyone. I give you my heart. I give you my soul. Okay. <laughs> Just relax, all right, Chan? Just relax, okay? How are we gonna stimulate those brain cells of yours if you're not relaxed, hmm? Okay, now just close your eyes. Close your eyes. Okay. Now, just picture yourself on a nice, quiet beach. Sound of the waves on the pristine sand. Feel the breeze. The warm sun on your face. Just relax. Just see it all clearly. 
in your mind. here. What's up with you? You're breaking the school rules. Always such a goody two-shoes. If you're not careful and the teachers or prefects see you, they will confiscate your phone. Come here. If I tell you a secret, will you promise not to tell anyone? So, there's a boy, I like him, and he likes me too. You, I thought we hated boys. But he's not like the boys in our school. He's much older, and he's my soulmate. What's a soulmate? It sounds so icky. It's not okay. Who is it? He gave me this ring. It's rose gold. Pretty, right? It's pretty, but who is this boy? Is he P5? Don't tell me he's P6. He's much older than that. Ew. How can he like a much, much older guy? You're so childish. You won't understand. Jaden. Where are you off to? Lunch. It's 11 a.m. Early lunch. With a client? No one you don't know about. Who? Well, okay, Zhong Ming. Zhong Ming again? You were supposed to update me about any communication you have with him. Well, he hasn't told me what the meeting's about, and I was going to update you after the meeting. And it didn't even occur to you to ask me to join the both of you? Can we please take this inside? Look, I know you're busy. And as you said, being a lawyer is all about relationships. And I have a relationship with our clients, so... You have a relationship with me too. I'm your boss, but you keep overstepping your boundaries. So you're telling me you don't like it? No, I never have. And you said you were going to update me after your lunch with Chong Ming? I don't believe you. How can I prove that? That's just something you're going to have to trust me with. <laughs> That's the problem, Jaden. I don't trust you. I don't trust that you're going to tell me the next time Zhong Ming contacts you to seek advice. I don't trust that you're going to be upfront with me with our clients. And I don't trust that you're going to be respectful and professional towards me in this working environment. Okay, look, I... I'm sorry, okay? For all my mistakes. But I'm certain that with your guidance, I'll be able to become an even better assistant to you. A broken trust is hard to mend. It's just so hard being professional around you when all I want to do is... When all you want to do is what? So tell me, boss, how can I regain your trust? This is not going to work. Jaden, you're fired. 
What? I want you to pack your bags and leave. <laughs> You're not thinking straight. Don't do something you'll regret. No regrets. I've never seen you so focused before. Oi! Don't you have Chinese test tomorrow? So all this nonsense, fail then you know her. I don't care if I fail my test. As long as I get into program. It's really unique. Hmm. At least someone here has better taste than you, Gundu. Hey. Oh. Oh. Oh, there Stop you! Stop it! You don't to throw, is it? Ow! Stop it! Can't get there. Stop it! Huh? Stop it! <laughs> Stop it, Akali! Stop it! Stop it! We stun! We stun! Block me now! We stun! All done. If there's leftovers, you can uh, heat them up for dinner. You really didn't have to. It's my passion. You're doing me a favour every time you let me take over your kitchen. See you next week. Yeah. Here. Instead of cooking for us, why don't I take you out for lunch? Uh, the kids have school, so you're talking about a weekend? A weekday. No kids. Oh, no kids? <clears throat> Just you and me. Okay. <laughs> okay, yes. Yeah, yeah, that sounds wonderful. <laughs> Lunch then. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye. you when you met Ba? We were young. We met in university. How about your first boyfriend? Was it Uncle Bing Han? How old were you then? Why are you asking me this, Hilary? Do you have a boyfriend? No. I'm asking for a friend. Who? Nabila? I can't tell you who. I promised. Hillary, is it? Hillary? Hello? Selena? You know, for everything the other parents say about Grace Chang, I quite like her. <laughs> Maybe I should take away Nabila's phone too. Implement the same policy at home? Is Nabila on her phone all the time? Well, I can say that, but I have to admit though, I'm not setting the best example. And she seems really moody these days, and secretive too. Maybe she's going through adolescence early. I mean, she's pretty tall for her age. Well, at least I solved one problem today. I finally fired Jaden. Jaden wasn't just a work problem. He was a family problem too. Yeah, and I never liked him. He was always too sleek, you know? And after what he did to Zachary, you did the right thing. Alright, going back to family problems. At least with Nabs, I know Claude is helping me watch over her. Mm. You know, he seems really good with kids for someone who doesn't have any. He was always quite big brotherly in school too. Even if she's keeping secrets from me, maybe she's confiding in Claude and I know he would tell me if there's anything wrong. Hilary asked me about boyfriends earlier. <laughs> boyfriends? In primary three? Why? Does she have one? <laughs> no. She said it was a secret and she couldn't tell why she was asking. Did Nabila say anything about a boy? 
No. Why? What did Hillary say? She didn't mention names, but you may want to check. Maybe Nabila's behaviour is not just caused by teenage mood swings. I may be overreacting, but it's better to be safe. Privacy. Why are you so secretive with your phone? Are you hiding something? No! Naps, if you have a boyfriend, you need to tell I me. don't have a boyfriend! If you're ever in a situation with a boy, and if he makes you uncomfortable, or pressures you into doing something you do not want to do, you need to tell me. Do you understand? Why are you being such a witch? Are you going through premature menopause? No! Give me your phone. No, you can't just look through my thing! Not just going through your things, I'm confiscating your phone. You can't just do that. Now watch me. Give it. To me. I hate you. I don't know what's up with her. Should I go and talk to her? No, just let her come down first. So, I fired Jaden. For coming on to you? He was bad news. I should have seen it from the start. I saw the both of you. I saw him doing that dance. Then you saw me stopping his nonsense too, right? I didn't stay for that part. I don't know what else I should say to make you believe me. Were you tempted? Because he's driven like you? I'm sorry about what I said the other night. I didn't mean it that way. Look, I don't know what I was thinking. All I know is I was sleeping on a job. I didn't protect our marriage. You are my world, Reza. I know I don't tell you that often enough. And sometimes I forgot to put you first. But never again. It's not gonna happen again. This whole thing just... It makes me look like I'm such a monster. is to keep you safe, to give you
you the best life has to offer and to help you all achieve all your dreams. Pass me my spanner. Oh, shit. Hey, can you pass me the bigger one? Oi. Standing on the edge, I see. Starting point where there's no limit. Look up, I'm done with Oi. looking down. Oi, Winston. Where's the spanner? People told me not to dream to live Wait, in Winston. the reality. Oi, but I Winston. am walking through those doors. Oi! What are you doing? What do you think? You look so, so different. Wow! Not bad in your recycled fashion. It's reusable fashion, Gundo. Same la. Can we take a photo? Quick. You're definitely going to get into the program. Hey! What are you doing? And the whole world is going to know my name. Hey, Naps. Mr. Claude, my mom confiscated my phone. Oh. Did she find anything? No. I hid our conversations in the hidden folder like you said. But what if she finds the folder? Is there any way you think you can get your hands on the phone and delete the folder? I think it's in her handbag. Has she brought up anything about the phone since taking it? But I think she knows something is different. She asked where the other present came from. The ring? No, the headband. Don't show her the ring. In fact, don't say anything. I think I should. I should tell her about us. Why would you want to do that, Nabs? She wanted to talk to me about boys the other day. I think she suspects. I don't think it's a good idea to say anything to your mom. But she really likes you so much. I think she'll be so happy. I'll tell her we're soulmates. <sighs> Nabs, I've met a lot of parents like your mom. And trust me, she will not understand. Anyway, all she cares about is your exam results, right? Can you stop? Massaging. I thought you liked this. It's uncomfortable. Nams, I don't think it's a good idea to tell your mom or your parents, anything about us. I mean, can you imagine what they would say if they saw this? Where do you get that? You sent it to me. You don't remember? I didn't. Enough distractions. Let's get to work. Where's your exercise book? This is Pa. This is my final product. Oh, yes. Let's take a look at this, Kylie. I made this using recycled fabric scrap. Uh huh. And I sew everything myself. Oh, I see. Very nice, Kylie. Very beautiful. Yes. Let's hope you will get in. Thank you, Mrs. Pa. You're welcome. Hi. 
Hello. Hey. <laughs> Good to see you after all these years. And you still remember me over the phone. Of course I remember you. Selena Ang, the school bell. <laughs> Have a seat. So, are you going for the school reunion? Yes, I am. You? Mm hmm Just wondering whether you uh, still keep in touch with Ing Hien? Yes, I meet him sometimes. Oh. Coffee, please. Benny and I used to date a little after you and Kion got together. Oh. I think about that time a lot, especially after my divorce. I never felt good about how badly we ended when we were 18. I blew him off. I see. But now, I really want to reconnect with Benny. And... Do you know if he's seeing anyone? I. I think he's single. I thought he would be. He never really recovered from us. Called me many times. Do you think it would be strange if I, you know, give him a call out of the blue and, and ask him out for a meal? Well... <laughs> I'm actually meeting him for lunch tomorrow. You know what? I think it would be great if I could just show up and and surprise him. It'll be fun. <sighs> hey, Sam. How's your homework going? Mummy, can we cancel tuition with Mr. Cloud today? I'm tired. But isn't your GEP entrance exams coming soon? Yeah, but... I can't prepare without the GEP app on my phone. And... I'm scared Mr. Cloud will get angry. Is everything okay in school? Yeah. Did you make any new friends lately? Hmm... Why are you at home? What? It's a Friday. You're usually at work on weekdays and busy with Harris on weekends. Look, Sayang, I'm sorry. I know I've been very busy lately. But I thought I could spend some time with you before I leave for the office. Okay, let's do this. This weekend, you and me, we go on a movie date. Just the two of us. I... I have to study for GP. Is this about your phone naps? You can have it back. Next week after our movie date, alright? See how. Yeah. Well done. Wow, you, yours is very nice. You show in this. Settle down now. Be quiet. Before I announce the results, I must highlight some basic criteria. For those of you who feel 
any of the SA1 test, I'm sorry, but you don't qualify for this program. But, Mrs. Pla, you didn't tell us about the criteria before. I already mentioned, we received quite a lot of submissions, so we can only choose four. All program participants need to do well in their core subjects before being considered for the program. Your idea was nice, but better spend more time studying. It's better to improve your grades than to do well in extracurricular activities. If I read out your name, you can stay for the program briefing. Marcus T. Victor Lim. Daphne Ming. I was reading this poem and it made me think of you. My soul spills into yours and it's blended. Because my soul has absorbed your fragrance, I cherish it. Afternoon, Nabil. Hi. Hello, Mr. Claude. Any update on your mom and your phone? Just see if you can get it for five minutes. So you can delete our folder. Okay? You name the folder unused apps, right? You'll always be my champ. My star student. You know, Nabs, being a tuition teacher is not easy. There's a lot of stress involved. Anxious parents are tough to deal with. But I don't need to tell you that, right? You know, I'm always the one massaging you. I thought you might help me relax today. Can you help me? Help me relax. How? Don't worry about that. Finish your sums first. What are you doing? <laughs> Stop it! What happened? <laughs> you didn't get in? <laughs> Kylie! Kylie!
I didn't know you two kept in touch. Oh, we didn't. Chi was kind enough to invite me. Thank you, Chi. She's too kind. Hello, dude. I'll come right over. Is everything okay? That's been an emergency. I need to go. Freda, Claude, he's a sexual predator and not is with him now. What? I checked her phone. There are naked pictures. There are lots of naked pictures. I shouldn't have listened to her. She didn't want to go for tuition today. Okay, I'll call the police. 